Hello, ghost hunters. What are your go-to tools when hunting ghosts? I recently asked this very question on my channel. While many voted, some actually left an explanation of why they bring some less typical tools when hunting ghosts. Not surprisingly, the EMF was the strong winner here, but there were a few other interesting ideas from ghost hunters. But for today's video, I want to focus on this one here. So maybe your reaction is like mine. Candles? If you've been watching my channel since the beginning of Phasmophobia, then you know that I actually agree with this poster suggestion. But why? In some of my first how-to Phasmophobia videos, I mentioned that your best tool is your ears. In fact, more often than not, players follow sounds to find their ghost. So in today's video, I put that to the test. Here's a couple of examples of using the candle, lighter, and flashlight setup. Open a door. Did you hear a door? Sure did. Alright, well, this is where it's at. Give me a sign. Give me a sign again. Open a door. Are you in this room? Ring the phone. Make a sound. Oh, there you are. I found you with the candle. Give me a sign. It's gotta be above me. Like right above me. Or it's right here. Okay, so a few tips in regards to candles. First, they mitigate sanity drain from darkness, but do not prevent sanity drain from other sources such as ghost events or teammates dying. Candles that are found in the location are dimmer than those purchased and brought with ghost hunters. Candles do not work in the rain. Well, at least the heavy rain. So for some maps, like Maple Lodge Campsite, they may not be as useful depending on the weather. Candles are not electrical, so players can use them during a hunt. Candles burn out over time, so while there is an objective for the ghost blowing out a candle, it is possible that your candle will burn out naturally. Only one ghost has a chance of starting a hunt immediately after blowing out a candle, the Unroyo. So my personal verdict, candles are useful. If you're playing solo and you're concerned about losing sanity, it is probably worth it to bring a candle for your initial sweep of the area. These may be especially useful on large locations, with or without teammates, as it can help you determine where to focus your hunt without sacrificing any of your sanity. However, despite these awesome perks, they do make your hunts considerably longer. So are they worth it? Only you can decide. If you didn't vote on my poll, you can find it under the community tab on my channel. If you use a unique setup, let me know what that is. If you think candles are especially useful on your ghost hunts, tell me why in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and as always, happy hunting.